Okay, so here's a quick video on how to export um, racks. So I'm going to find a rack that I've already made. Um, let's go into uh, instrument racks and I'll just put one here. So I can delete any tracks that I'm not using. And so I've just got the one track with the one rack on it. And let's do a save. So I'm going to go and I'm going to save that to my desktop just so I can get rid of it later on more easily. And I'll also do a collect and save. Tick all of these if you want to make sure you bring everything with you. Then we want to go to uh, manage projects. Oh, sorry, manage files and manage project over here. So we hit that. And we can create a pack. So we hit create pack. I'm going to leave it with this name and also save that to the desktop. So if you have a look at my desktop now, that's the session that I just created, and that's the pack, and inside it is the rack that I just made. If you want to um, export multiple racks within the one pack, you can do that. So I'm going to just pick a few different ones. So these are all uh, racks that I've made. And I could test them out, see that they're playing. So you can't really hear that because it's really low volume, but. Um, you can see that it's doing something. There we go. This one. So just going to go a few octaves lower. Again. Again. Okay. And. So there we have that. I'm going to do another collect and save before I make the make the project just to be safe. So now I have a project with these three uh, racks inside them and if we manage project, create pack and I'll call this uh, test 2, save to the desktop. Okay and then let's have a look at what happens there. So I'll quit the project quit live altogether and I've created two packs. This first one has a single rack in it uh, with everything associated with that and this second one has the three racks that I just showed you and then if you want to import these you'd open a new set <coughs> and you can do um, you can do install pack so I'll install the first one that's on my desktop. Let's pick. That's the first one that I made. Open that. Now I've already created a um, folder called My Packs, which is in my music folder under Ableton My Packs. So I can install the pack here if I want. You guys can create your own location. Okay, so that. That should now be installed here. And let's give it a moment to update. And there it is. And this is the instrument that we made called that I made before called AM Billy Slide. And there it is. So we record enable. <laughs>